Hi. So this is a very uh, common question that I get and my branches get. Uh, sir, what is the ideal age to start the first career counseling session? Because when you look around us, I think many people have progressed and they have now they are now choosing the career of their kids and the kids are also encouraging their parents to go for you know an ideal career test or a stream selection test after class 10th before you decide on medical non medical science or arts to pursue your higher education vis a vis 25 years back where the hierarchy was very clear medical non medical mm -hmm. commerce and arts now things are changing people who understand the importance of career choices and the importance of aptitude and uh, inherent iq have already started adopting this methodology of choosing the right career at the right age but having said that as i said many people ask me so sir uh, i think as we are finishing class 10th that is the right time to take up these tests and figure out what our child uh, is looking at or needs or want and i say no maybe class 5th 6th is too early because many kids are not able to even answer the questions but with my personal experience i have seen that somewhere middle of class 9th is also good enough for you to take the take up this test and figure out the future of your kid i tell you why the reason for that is <coughs> people ask me what is the need because anyway we don't have to take a decision in class 9th of which team to choose but you have to because of the marketing of few iit and medical coaching institutes especially i see students and sorry parents forcing their kids to join a top iit coaching or a top neet coaching foundation programs as soon as class 8th so that is the reason that maybe you need to take this test early if your child doesn't like sciences the child doesn't like engineering that much maybe you are wasting your time and energy and money and you are putting the kid in unnecessary pressure by putting them in those classes at the age of class you know starting of class 7th or 8th generally i always say that you need need not do that early preparation the starting with class 11th is good enough at max class 9th should i say well definitely not below that so if you are to if you are starting a neat or a je preparation in class 8th really i don't know how i can counsel or mentor those families or those parents or those kids is too much of desperation let me put it in simple words but starting class 9th even if you are thinking about this thing i think uh, with my experience of dealing with hundreds of kids kid is good enough the kid is able to understand the questions which are asked in their psychometric tests the kid is able to have a mature discussion with the counselor or a mentor and you are easily figure out that is this kid is looking medicine as a as a choice of the person's life does he want to be a doctor because he loves treating people does he want to be an engineer because he loves creating new stuff technologically and if that is not the case why to unnecessary push or put your child in the pressure of taking sciences and start with the foundation courses of top iit or neet coaching institutes in class 9th and going for four hour classes in the evening every day you know, i i know few pay kids poor kids let me put it as early as class 9th coming back from school at 3 o'clock uh, just taking a rest for half an hour and then going back again to 4 to 7 foundation class and then coming back and again taking maybe an art tuition for your other two subjects which are not covered in those foundation class class 9th kid you know 14 year old only maybe you can do that if your child is super bright and you are looking at a ivy league institute or an iit or a government aims for medical entrance the competition is tough in india and i will not completely say no do again i say as a parent and of course along with counselor i always say that you can wait for a couple of more years if your kid ha has in it him she or he will make it even after two years of preparation in class 11 12 and if she doesn't have it in it or he doesn't have it in it then four years are also not going to be good enough 9th 10th is also anyway very basic education in indian system but imagine your kid is not up to that mark he or eventually he doesn't or she doesn't like that course why the hell you are spoiling her or his childhood of class 9th and 10th by putting into those courses maybe the person is an average above average uh, intelligence who can do many thing else in life so these two years class 9 10th are still the time where a student is still exploring the life uh, the the student should have time to go for swimming classes chess classes acting classes music classes in the evening if needed whatever choice whatever 
liking he has something which can be figured out easily by the class school teachers and i and i hear you know some kids tell me you know the music teacher always praises that person to be a good singer a good dancer or the games teacher always tell your kid is very very energetic or he he have something to be good in sports so let these two years class 9th and 10th give your child to further explore his or her true potential and uh, figure out what is uh, best for him or her maybe he is not a uh, uh, iit or uh, aims or uh, mc material and uh, even if he is the material but he doesn't want to do pursue that profession maybe he or she wants to be a great architect a great lawyer a great creative designer a great designer a great ui designer a army person uh, so many courses are now available across the world which gives you great profession great money great satisfaction so why the hell still we are running after two courses iit and medical iit and medical iit and medical so <coughs> give, give two more years contact a career counselor in class 9th itself uh, take this psychometric test but take a heart to heart discussion maybe you will realize that uh, you still <coughs> have two more years take the guidance of the counselor let the kid explore another two years maybe class 10th have board exam and you will like to score more marks in board in whatever situation so even that is fine but the entire class 9th half of the class 10th i think let the kid explore uh, with, under the guidance of a right uh, career counselor and mentor so that by the end of class 10th you clearly know that whether your kid is going to have a academic career and then within academic career there are different uh, subjects or maybe your kid would be great in a non academic career which is having slight academics but more of uh, personality or more of extrovert nature or maybe the kid is going to be very good in hospitality industry or maybe very good in any creative industry or maybe very good in any designing industry mm-hmm. or mm-hmm. fashion industry so so <coughs> let that exploration continue at least till class 10th before we take a hard decision of putting that student grilling 12 hours a day in only studies after school which many parents are forcing their kid in as early as in class 9th or 8th no so 9th 10th let the kid explore let the kid uh, take uh, a counseling session or a mentoring session maybe couple of them and uh, keep doing stuff which makes your kid all rounder in this age uh, i hope it is clear uh, for any questions always feel free to contact us or any of our branches have a nice day